Boom, baby. Boom. Rise. Shine. The light that's in your heart into the world. This one's going to be a tough one because I've been talking about a tough subject here for the last week. Sobriety is not easy. Uh, It's the sober September and that cued all sorts of things that makes us go into a discomfortable, discomforting feeling. Like it's an unequal, I don't feel okay inside feeling. And then I realized that that's exactly what sobriety is. It's enduring that feeling without escaping or running to the next whatever makes you feel okay faster. And there's so many things that we have that are triggers. You know, there's like so many emotional triggers and life triggers and thought triggers. And each one of these things will make us run to the next fix. We all have a fix. That's why I call it Saints Addiction. Not one of us is addiction free. It's just facts. We all have something that we turn to. I like to turn to sugar real quick. I've learned that about myself too. Trying to give up sugar was hard for me this week. Um, I'm not smoking weed in the show. Not so hard for me. Weed's the easy one. Um, But thoughts. Thoughts are the hardest ones of them all. I think of all the random thoughts that come into someone's head randomly. You know, it's going to be fast, it's going to be rapid, and then we're going to run to our stimulus even more rapid. We want a reinforcer. We want something to alleviate our pain. And that's where we're all the same. All of us running away from discomfort and uh, enduring it. That's where, like, the viva happens, the magic happens, is for all of us to get some sort of solace from our lives, right? Some actual recovery into our lives that's i think what the best part of sobriety is is us to reflect on these things instead of run from them and that's not easy to do i posted it today how many people can say that they're not on some kind of drug they're not on some kind of pill they're not on some kind of meth or something how many people can say that i can't and in my sobriety i found solace i can find myself i can answer real questions about myself i can answer reach deeper into myself and go what are these triggers inside of me i'm not i'm as human as you are what kind of things make me race to a bottle or race to a relationship and we do these things to make ourselves feel comfortable even though they're dangerous to us that was something that was thinking that so deeply uh, about addiction is these things are dangerous to us and i put saints in front of the word addiction to pick healthier addictions you know i like shirts it hasn't harmed me in any way working out hasn't harmed me in any way but it can be too much right like all things it becomes too much and then you have to be yourself and that's what i wanted to holler out today is being yourself and being comfortable in yourself being able to endure things that's really what life's about then you're living and not escaping and i think that's sort of been really the title of the show is living over escaping and all of us want to escape away from our problems everybody wants to run away from things that don't feel great inside but guess what endurance enduring the things is living through them is part of the experience and finding answers is better than finding an escape so as we all know everything that feels good temporarily wears away and then eventually you have to be yourself and eventually we all find that bottom where we're like okay that didn't work that didn't work that didn't work that drug that sex that uh whatever was firing the food like these top three things you know everyone can say i me you know i have have escapism and uh facism you know let's face what we see inside of ourselves let's face our questions our demons and answer these things for real inside of ourselves itself what makes me really happy and go find those things instead of the fake things now it's like that's fake energy i want you to find real energy because that's sustainable and that's what i'm all about so on my heart from the start it's a beautiful sunset it's your afternoon midnight marijuana motivation and i'm gonna go be me and be free and enjoy the rest of this day peace and love and as always bless